Hello everyone, welcome to Take a Walk with Me, Doctor's Orders. I'm having problems with YouTube this morning. When I went to upload my uh, morning devotions, you go to, um, when you start it on YouTube, then you go to YouTube Studio to set the, to, for it to be monetized. You set it for, uh, not for children. And you also set if you want a different, you know, a custom thumbnail. Um, it did okay until I went to press save on each one and it won't it won't save it. I don't understand. I've never had that problem before. Uh, but for some reason that's what it's doing. It went ahead and uploaded, but it's supposed to say, you know, that it's not for kids and it won't let me do it. So I don't know if hopefully it's YouTube and not anything to do with my phone or anything like that. So if you notice the thumbnails or just whatever comes up, that's that's why right now until they until I figure out what the what they're doing but uh, also I went out to the garden you know I always go out there and look around something's been digging in my garden um, I don't know it it looked like prints like footprints out there too I don't know if a cat would get out there and dig in it or if it's a rabbit that's going, coming out there early in the morning but um, I'm gonna have to do something I don't know what to do uh, I got a pie pan out there, but it doesn't seem to be doing the job with whatever this is. Because it was in both of them. Luckily, nothing, uh, just a few little plants were uh, affected. You know, that it, it didn't chew on them. It more like was digging around them and just knocked them around. I don't know if it's maybe looking for worms or what's, what it's doing, really. But I'll have to figure it out or I'm going to have some damage. Um, on our weather report today, today's Friday, 522. The current temperature is 55 degrees. The high today is 74. Chance of rain is 80%. And the wind is 3 miles per hour. I already looked at the rainfall gauge for the, uh, with the squirrel, and there's just trace amount. It wasn't, you know, hardly, you couldn't even hardly measure it. Um, I'm going to mention this this last time because today I'm doing the drawing for the two winners for the garden giveaway hashtag garden giveaway so here's the rules you must be subscribed press the like button in the comments put hashtag garden giveaway it's only available in the u.s and youtube is not involved um like i say i'm having two winners so your chances are real good uh, winner will, winners will receive a package of various vegetable and flower seeds, including stump flower seeds. And the winners will be picked this afternoon sometime. <clears throat> uh, I'm going to check the comments on this video <clears throat> before I do the drawing. So here's your absolute last chance. Um, I was hoping to have a lot of uh, people that were, you know, entered in this one. I, I thought they would, so... I, I'm here maybe you just haven't seen the video you know one of the videos that that talks about it so um, here's your chance everybody uh, put in the comments hashtag garden giveaway and I'll get you entered okay so <clears throat> let me get a drink of coffee here <laughs> yeah I've never had that happen not one time with uh, YouTube studio try you know uploading a video and having to ch do the things you're supposed to do and it's impossible pretty much to get a hold of them to actually talk to a person and if you uh, if you like do a search and ask a question it just directs you to a bunch of uh, videos and stuff but sometimes they help sometimes they just they don't seem to work, whatever it is they say to do. I pretty much, uh, I should have left the holes like they were so I could have shown you what it was doing. It dug, here's a little one. Right down in here, that almost looks like a footprint or something though. As you can see right there right there and you see over here around this uh, cucumbers right there you see 
That area been dug around it, you can tell. Something's digging. See how that does when the wind blows? It's supposed to scare them off. I mean, it scares the, the birds and stuff. See, here's one right there. And see, that's where my carrots are planted. You can see just a little, few little ones trying to grow, but it's dug some of them. There's a few of them carrots coming up, Joe, with this one. These other ones over here are coming up pretty good. There's the white ones. You can see another one right there, a hole. It's like it's looking for worms or something, whatever it is. Could be, I don't know, could be a possum or something even around here. These, uh, see it's messed up some of these carrots. See these white ones, carrots are starting to come up, Joe. There's some more holes down in here. And I already covered up a bunch, you know, fixed a bunch of the holes. They're all over like it was digging for something. So if y'all know what's going, what might be that I don't. Let me see some. So there's two of those cucumbers trying to go up, grow up. Out. And I see another one trying to come through the soil. A couple of them were dug up by whatever's doing this the other day. So, you can see this row's incomplete where it's messed up some there. I don't know how they got, see how they got all scattered around? That's because it was digging around and moving the seeds, I guess, the other day. I mean, before these even sprouted, I believe. I'd like to know what it is. What to do. I don't want things damaged, you know. And there was a few in here. Little places. I covered them up. You can see where it's been disturbed here. Right there. There was a hole right here. That's aggravating. Something come around when you're not out out here and stuff. These little cute uh, cabbages starting to look cute already. Like a little cabbagey trying to get in the middle. I hope it doesn't ruin anything. Kind of makes me mad as much work as I put into it. I did some work over here at this rock. If you see there's even holes in the yard, look at that. Something is digging around. I see these a lot too. It's digging. It's something that's digging. I don't know if it's a rabbit. I don't know, would a rabbit eat worms? No. Really not. There's plenty of food over here for them. Squirrel? I bet it's a squirrel. It's a squirrel or a rabbit or something like that. I don't think a cat would do anything like that. But yeah, I brought some good, some better dirt out here, as you can see, the black dirt. And I planted our sunflowers. Here they are. And this is stump flower right here. It's going to be a good one. All of them. There's all around here. But there's the two sunflowers. That's in, right beside each other. And I got two right here. Right there. And I think this is going to start growing better now. Up here since I put a little bit of dirt here and there. And I planted some seeds. I put some dirt in this crevice here. And I planted some seeds in it. I thought that would be pretty them growing out of the rock like. Yeah, that aggravates me. I don't think a chipmunk would dig like that. I really believe it's probably a squirrel. Because there was three out here this morning. I don't know what to do about it. I certainly wouldn't harm them in any way. I'm going to have to find something that will scare them off. I wonder if an owl figurine would scare them off. What do y'all think? Would an owl figurine scare a, 
or a squirrel or a rabbit off. So I'm not going to let something sit here and destroy my garden every night when I wake up or come out here in the morning. I was just looking at those. I don't know if I emptied the rain gauge out here yesterday. Yeah, because it's just got trace too. Yeah, I must have emptied it. Well, getting plenty more blooms on these, on these blue ones. Man, looking good. Stuff growing in there. That's starting to have some pop out on it. Kind of cloudy, I'd say it'll rain at some point in time. Let's see how stump flower number two is. I put three uh, sunflowers, no, and this one here. That one was underneath the soil still, so I don't know if it'll work or not. I see some ants. I don't think they'll bother them, but I thought it'd be pretty if some, uh, if some sunflowers grew out here. There's a seed. Plant it. There's something red coming up right there. And Right here and right here. I don't know if that's something from the original tree or what. Well, it's coming along. It'll take them a while for these flowers to grow. I hope YouTube straighten out or straightens out that problem. Because I can't set it as, you know, not for children if they don't have it to where you can save it. It's nice out that way, but it's a little cloudy over there. Yeah, I have a feeling it's squirrels doing that, but I didn't think they would eat worms or whatever it is they're looking for. They Maybe they think there's some nuts underneath there or something. They're digging. That's kind of the way it looks. Because they'll dig them holes in the yard like that and put to bury their nuts if they find. Yeah, you can watch them out here burying them. So it just seems like that's what they're doing or something. Maybe they're burying nuts in my... I bet they're burying nuts in there. If I find one, I'll, I'm going to look down in one of those holes next time. Dig down a little ways. See if they're burying them in there. Like I said, I wouldn't dare harm them. But I sure want to try to scare them off somehow. Can't afford one of those owls yet. Maybe I could find one on Amazon. Whenever I can get one. I guarantee they got one on Amazon. I've seen them elsewhere, about 20 bucks. I think that's kind of expensive. So I wanted Evergreen for 20 some dollars, or around 20. Everything's kind of high there. I'm hoping maybe they're cheaper somewhere else. What are y'all having for dinner? Well, I forgot, or we forgot, not just me, forgot to set out that uh, ground chuck last yesterday afternoon or evening. We forgot to put it in the fridge to thaw. We were going to cook out burgers tonight. 
Well, you know how it goes. I was so tired, and I just, I had a million thoughts in my head. I've been having some, you know, a little bit of anxiety lately. Uh, over different things going on. And, uh, I just plumb forgot about it. So, plan B. Gotta always have a plan B. I'm going to fix those stuffed shells, I guess. I was going to do that in a few days. Oh, you know what, though? Hmm, I usually, I've been fixing them with meat. I may have to get some. One way or another, I probably have to get some meat for tonight. Because I have, I would have had to thaw out the, I don't really like uh, cooking, browning uh, ground meat right from frozen. I mean, you can do it, but you got to stay there about the whole time. If you do it that way. I don't know what we'll do. We'll either have shells with no meat in the sauce or have to go get some. Either way, I need some, uh, I need some lighter fluid for my grill too. So we may have to go somewhere today, but we're not going to spend much, that's for sure. It's getting towards the end of the month and we just don't have it. So, I'm sure a lot of people are that way though. See a few more blooms. Tomatoes. Well, everybody, I hope you enjoyed today's walk with me. Please press the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell so that you get all my videos as soon as they come out. Everybody have a great day, and I'll do something or other today later on. And we'll also be doing the uh, giveaway uh, this evening. So, everybody have a great day, and I'll see you later. God bless.